this straight. I just finished my NFL draft live stream. And as I'm wrapping up, I come across this recent news, just break, I guess, breaking news. So from New Japan Pro Wrestling, there will be a brand new NJPW Strong Women's Championship. And there will be a one-night tournament to crown the inaugural champion at NJPW Strong Resurgence on May 21st. So, what about the IWGP Women's Championship? Hold on, let me let me let me recheck my sources. Let me let me let me check something. I'm looking at looking at the wiki page. The IWGP Women's Championship. This title owned by New Japan Pro Wrestling, is exclusively defended on shows promoted by NJPW, not only in Japan, not only in Japan, but worldwide, with talent from NJPW's sister promotion, World Wonder Ring Stardom, as its primary contenders. Defended on shows promoted by NJPW worldwide. Not only in Japan, but worldwide. Okay? This title isn't even six months old yet. You've already have three champions, and already y'all are making another women's championship. Why? Why? Like, this makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. You have the IWGP Women's Championship sitting right there, which you specifically have set to be showcased and defended on NJPW promoted shows, not only in Japan, but worldwide. That that's what it says. That that's what it says. So what is the purpose of this NJPW Strong Women's Championship. Not only that, let's take a look at the competitors for this tournament, which are only four. Four competitors. We got Willow Nightingale. We got Momo Kogo. Stephanie Van Cure and Mercedes Monet. Mercedes Monet, who was just IWGP Women's Champion and just lost the title to Mayu Iwatani at All Star Grand Queendom. So, 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 what? What, are you going to just put this new title on Mercedes now? Like, that makes no sense. Why? What? What? This is so totally set up for Mercedes 
to win. Like, I can't imagine how this isn't a setup for Mercedes to win, to just get a new title on her. Not to mention, she's not even signed. She's a free agent. Because, I mean, think about it. Momo Kogo's not winning this title. Stephanie Van Keer is not winning this title. Willow, I mean, <laughs> fat chance, but she's not winning this title. Not at this tournament. She's been too busy with ROH and AEW, which I honestly feel like she should win either of the titles on either of those promotions, you know, in all honesty, but that's just me. But even still, it's like, <laughs> oh, somebody make it make sense to me. Somebody please make it make sense to me. Like, what? The IWGP Women's Championship isn't even six months old and already they've made another Women's Championship. Wh what? So... <laughs> wow. 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 Somebody's going to have to help me understand this head scratcher of an announcement. Like, what's the point? What is the literal point? I mean... Now, now, now it really makes me question. I, I, I just, I'm confused. I am confused. Like, like what? Like what? I'm confused. So like my whole my whole thing is this. So I guess the whole idea behind these strong these strong championships are they they're to be defended I guess on NJPW strong events or I guess events in the US. But my thing is, if your IWGP Women's Championship is supposed to be showcased and defended on NJPW promoted shows worldwide, not just Japan, but worldwide, then what what's the point of the what's the point of the NJPW Strong Women's Championship then? You could have just used the IWGP women's title to be showcased on the strong shows and on the regular NJPW shows. What's, what's wrong with that? Why couldn't y'all just do that? Why do you need another title belt? Like... Not to mention, this is totally set up to put a new title right back on Mercedes. Like, I just, I honestly don't see it any other way. Like, it's hard for me to see it any other way. With the four ladies they got in here, Stephanie Van Creer, um, Mercedes Monet, Willow Nightingale, Momo Kogo, and you're telling me they're not gonna put the title back on Mercedes? 
or not the title, but a new title on Mercedes after she just lost the IWGP Women's title? Like, this is ridiculous. Wow. I'm just, I'm shocked. Like, I really don't understand what, wh why? Why? Like, like, why? Like, this just feels so unnecessary. It just, it, it feels so unnecessary. It, it's just a ploy to get... To get a title right back on Mercedes. That's literally all this looks like. It's totally setting up for that to happen. I, 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 I'm done. I, I'm done. <coughs> I would love to get everybody else's input on this, but this move makes no sense to me. It, it makes no sense to me. I mean, that IWGP women's title barely has been showcased. There's already been three champs in... in and the belt's not even six months old yet. And there's already three champs. Barely defended. And now you've created another women's championship. Just, just like that. Yeah, I'm going uh, I'm to leave it at that. I'm going to leave it at that. Because y'all going to have to help me out. Help me to understand. Because this move makes absolutely no sense. And with the competitors, with Mercedes being in it, like, I, I can't see anybody else winning. Like, this is literally set up to put a belt back on Mercedes. It has to be. It has to be. Why else is she in this tournament? Anyway, I'm going to leave it at that. Y'all know the deal. Check out the link for Game Beauty, Blitzball Champ, promo code, 10% off. Let me know what y'all's honest thoughts are. And I'll put the link uh, to the Twitter post. But let me know what y'all's honest thoughts are. And if you can, help me to understand why this is even a thing now. Because I really feel like it's it's unnecessary. I think it's so unnecessary. Because if the whole point was this IWGP Women's Championship to be showcased in NJPW events worldwide, including Japan, including the States, including Europe, wherever, then what's the point of making this NJPW Strong Women's Championship? What's the point? You have a belt that you could showcase already at these NJPW Strong shows, why do you need to make another singles women's championship? It makes no sense to me. So y'all gonna have to help me out with that one. But yeah, I'm I'm done. I'm I'm totally done with this. Let me know what y'all's thoughts are. Um, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Thank you for watching. Um, for Blitzball Champ Gaming here on the YouTube the Tube with this pro wrestling rant my name's jason ingram have a blessed evening i'll see y'all next time peace